Wednesday's best music. Magic. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. The person who the New York Times deemed as the threat to become the most influential female rapper of the day, or at least the most popular, ladies and gentlemen, we have on line one. Kesha! How are you? Hello. Hi. It is such an honor to hear from you. Yes, you Yeah, know. I'm really excited to be here. <laughs> I can't believe we actually have you on the radio. Yeah, so um, <laughs> my, name is, uh, my name is Andy, and my partner here is Ricky. Hi. And, What's uh, up? And this is Magic 89.9. Welcome to the show. You're and live. Yes, and welcome to the Philippines. Yes. Thank you. I'm so excited. I've been awake for like 20 hours exploring. Oh, it's amazing. All you need Warrior is coffee mode. here. Are your mode? <laughs> All right. So before before the Philippines, where did you come from? Um, I came from Los Angeles. Before that was Alaska. Wow. Um, before that was Europe. I've been all over the place. So the heat probably shocked you when you got here, did it? <laughs> well, you know, I'm really, really excited to be here. I've never been here before, and it's just like an honor to be able to be here and play a show here. And, um, you, all right, so we know you've been traveling. What's mm-hmm. the most interesting place you've visited so far? You know, every place is interesting because mm-hmm. it's always like going to a different planet. But I really love, I mean, from what I've seen today, uh-huh. this place is so amazing. I went to this marketplace called, like, I forget which marketplace. It's but a green hill. Green hill. <laughs> yeah, Probably and there are people hill. selling dinosaur fossils and <laughs> made into earrings. And I got a bunch of... Pearls and I just had the most fabulous time and ate some very weird sweet things. Of course you I've did. I've been having an amazing time here, but really, I mean, everywhere I go is a little adventure. I can't pick this one place. No, no. I know that you said that you've never been here before. This is your first time. But prior to you coming here, did you hear anything about the Philippines at all? You know, I know there's amazing scuba diving here because I'm obsessed with yes. animals yes as you probably know and i'm also obsessed with scuba diving so i actually is something i want to do while i'm here mm-hmm. well, you should you yeah, should you hit should. up our beaches i want to i've, I've seen pictures they're beautiful mm-hmm. and uh, i know uh, how, about, how about telling us about your album what yes. makes it special for you my album is special because I wrote every song on it, nice. and they're all very personal to my life and my experiences, and it was also inspired by my fans. The title, Warrior, was inspired by meeting my fans and oh. hopefully inspiring them to be really strong versions of themselves. And anything you have to go through, whether it's a breakup or bullying at school or just people being generally not very nice, I mm-hmm. just encourage people to be a warrior. And I, I've had to do that myself, and I hope all of my fans feel that way. When they listen to my record, I hope they feel empowered. I oh, like nice. what you just I said. Know. Yeah, I do. Now we are inspired by you. Do you have any favorite song, though, in the album? The Warrior On my album. album, you know, honestly, I love Warrior for that reason. I hope it makes people just feel, like, ready to kick ass. Yes. And I really hope that people like Dirty Love, because that one is a collaboration <laughs> with one of my favorite artists of all time, Iggy Pop. Mm-hmm. So that one's one of my favorites. Okay. All right. And what are you expecting for this, for this concert? I know, you know, the Filipino people have been so excited. We've been yeah. promoting your concert for, like, months already. We're excited. So what can we expect from your concert? You know, I've had so many tweets and Facebook requests for me to come here. And it's, you know, it's been a couple of years in the making. And I've been really excited to come here. And I'm finally here. And I've gotten to explore this amazing, crazy city. And I just hope my fans come tomorrow ready to have the best night of their lives. Oh, we That's will. what I hope is that you get dressed up and you come oh. and make friends <laughs> with each other and dance all night long and get covered in glitter. That's all I want is to have the best biggest dance party in the world. Yay! That's awesome. Yeah, right? I love it. I love it so much. But hey, going back to your album, though, um, what was your favorite collaboration? My favorite collaboration? Well, you know, working with Will I Am was amazing. Oh, yeah. He is hilarious and weird and wild. <laughs> and that was really fun. But I also collaborated with the drummer of the Black Keys, and the Black Keys are a rock band. Mm-hmm, and so mm-hmm. a lot of people thought maybe that was a strange combination. But all over this record, I collaborated with Iggy Pop, who's a punk rock icon, and then the Flaming Lips with their, like, psychedelic rock idols. So, I mean, I loved them all, but for different reasons. I feel like in art, you can 
really cross genres and cross boundaries and break the rules. I feel like in art, there shouldn't be any rules. Exactly. And so I was trying to kind of show people that there are no rules in art. You can do whatever you want. Well said. I like that. Well right. said. Kesha on the phone with us. Uh, Kesha, what's uh, what's your future collaboration or do you have any future plans? You're coming out with an album soon or? Still, yeah, still. Still the beans. <laughs> well, I recently just put out a song called Timber with mm-hmm. my friend Pitbull, and hopefully you guys are rocking that and loving that. I, that came out just, you know, a couple of weeks ago. But I have a couple of things up my sleeve. Nothing has come to fruition yet, but I am writing songs. I recently broke up with this guy who's a total jerk. So oh, how material. dare he? <laughs> what? How dare he? I know. Well, I feel like for women everywhere, nice. it's my job to write the craziest, breakup songs <laughs> because every woman wants to so I'll do it for women everywhere you do that Kesha you do that <laughs> alright but you know we're so excited for your concert we are we are we really are tomorrow and we're excited to be covered in glitters mm-hmm. tomorrow as well mm-hmm. and uh, what's your message to all your Filipino fans invite them to your concert oh. please well, please come see me tomorrow. Please come to my show. It's going to be epic and amazing. And I'm so excited to be here, and I'm so excited to party with you guys. And seriously, I mean it when I say I am really could not be more <laughs> thrilled to finally be in the Philippines, and I'm going to bring the biggest, baddest, wildest dance party you've yeah. ever been to in your whole life. Woo, yeah, so hopefully I'll see you there it. tomorrow night. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so much, Kesha. Thank you. Yeah, of course. I can't wait to see you guys tomorrow night. Get ready. Yeah. We will definitely. <laughs> so thank you, and welcome again to the Philippines. Of course. Thank you, and I love you to all my Filipino fans. Bye, Kesha. Uh, we'll bye. See you bye, guys. Today's best music. Magic. Magic. 89.9.